Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And I'm gonna go around this brand new 2024 Chrysler Pacifica. This is a touring now, all wheel drive, and it is in Fathom Blue Pearl Coat. Paint coat is PPS, and I shoot all my videos in 4K. Now, if you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications and get updates on the videos I do each and every day. I'm gonna go all the way around, show you all the options, and just give you the most accurate representation of this brand new Chrysler Pacifica. This one does have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine, puts out 287 horsepower. It's gonna give you 25 miles per gallon highway, 17 city for an average of 20 miles per gallon. It is paired up with the nine speed automatic transmission and this one is an all wheel drive vehicle. You get the gloss black grill, the LED headlamps, running lights, and fog lights. They are super bright, and I'm gonna turn those on at the end of the video. This one has the 360 camera on it as well, and the pano roof for options. You get the seven, I'm sorry, 18 inch silver painted alloy wheels. It has Pirelli P0 all season tires. These are 245 60 R18s. And you can see the tread pattern on there, kind of an all season tread pattern. Fathom blue, one of my favorite colors on the minivans. Got some greens, some blues, turquoise in there, lots of metal flake, really a cool color, kind of changes colors in the different sunlight, so that's really neat. This one, you get the gloss black trim on the mirrors there. Has the enter and go system, four wheel disc brakes on all the Pacificas. You get the LED tail lamps here. Those light up completely across there and I'll turn those on at the end of the video so you can see those. This one does have the backup parking sensors, blind spot monitoring, um, has the power lift gate as well. It still has the stow and go seating even though it has all wheel drive. So to get these seats down in the third row, you just pull that lever pull number one and then pull number two. The seat will come on back and it'll go down nice and flat like that. We'll put the uh, second row seats down as well. The third row here gets two cup holders on each side or one cup holder on the driver's side actually. Two cup holders on the passenger side and then a little storage area on both sides. This is a power lift gate so you press that button to get it down and it'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent. You do get the chrome trimmed Pacifica and all wheel drive lettering on that gate. This one does have the capless fuel fill, which all the Pacificas do, but never get gas on your hands again. It's one of my favorite features on my car. Really a good looking color. Has the heated power mirrors, blind spot monitoring, built in directional signals, and then that 360 camera is right there. Let's take a quick look at the back seats. You get these second row quad seating back here, the captain's chairs with the armrests on them and uh, side window shades, rear air controls as well. And uh, you get factory floor mats back here. Now you can get these seats to go forward. So that's the easy entry access to that third row, which is a really nice over the old town and countries and the uh, grand caravans you kind of had to either crawl back there or put the seat all the way up um, to get these in the stow and go position this one does have stow and go assist so you press this button right here that front seat will go all the way up to where it needs to go you pull this tab right here lift that up and then you can pull the stow and go strap. You gotta make sure that the armrests are flush with the backrest otherwise you'll have problems but just pull that and it'll still right in there. So you can see even though they have the um, drive shaft in there, they can still get those seats down. And then this piece just goes down nice and flat and you're all set to go. Now what's really cool is when you press this button again, that seat will go back to its original spot so you don't have to readjust anything. You get on each one of these backrests of the front seats, you get the USB and USC USB-C plug-ins, which are really nice. We'll get these seats back up. So I'll show you how easy that is. 
So basically just the same process, just in reverse. Pull this strap again and it goes right up. Now when you pull this piece back down, you're gonna wanna grab there and then it goes down just like that. Press your still and go and it'll go back down. Get this door closed, press the button. You can see they go nice and smoothly. Up front, the Touring L package gives you the black leather bucket seats. Both seats got that white stitching on there. Power driver seat. Both these front seats are heated. Factory floor mats, auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel, power windows, locks and mirrors, and memory driver's seat. Let's hop inside, check out the instrument cluster and the radio. You get the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer, the nice blue hue around that instrument cluster. Comes with the heated leather wrapped steering wheel. Cruise controls on the right, adaptive cruise controls on the right as well. Bluetooth and information center controls and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. For those of you that aren't familiar with adaptive cruise control, this will keep you a certain distance behind the car in front of you. And uh, it'll make sure that you maintain that distance. Has the Uconnect 5 10.1 inch touchscreen radio, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on here. Bluetooth, USB, and AUX hookups as well. You get your climate controls, which includes your dual climate controls here, your heated seats, heated steering wheel controls, and then uh, we'll go to those cameras in just a second. These are all the different apps on here. So basically this is just links to different parts of the radio. So these are all the settings on there. So Android Auto, Apple CarPlay are wireless on the Uconnect 5 system. You get the gloss black surround on the controls and radio there. That looks really good. Let's check out all those cameras because those are a really nice feature as well. You get the surround view camera there, a normal backup camera, a wide view of the back, a wide view of the front, a narrow view of the front, and then your normal backup camera. So if you put a hitch on here, you could get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer the first time every time. And you can zoom in on that receiver hitch for even better results if you had one on here. Down here are your perpendicular and parallel park assist, your parking sensors, lane departure warning, start stop capabilities, and sta stability control, dual climb controls there, USB, two USBs, two USB C's, and an AUX jack. You get a coin holder and nice storage area there as well. More storage down there, 12 volt power point, more storage right here, two cup holders and more storage in there. Keyless entry has remote start, power lift gate, and side door buttons on it. And this one does have that panoramic Vista roof, second row fixed glass, power sunroof in front, which is a really nice feature, really brightens it up in here. You get map lights, side door controls on there as well, and rear gate controls. And let's turn all the lights on. So you can see just how bright they are. And then we're gonna check out that original window sticker at the end of the video, which will also be linked in the description on YouTube, as well as a link to this vehicle on our website if it's still available, so you can get all the pricing and incentives on this particular Pacifica. Our Pacificas have been going very fast. So let's do one walk around here with all those lights on. You can see they are very bright. They look really good too. I really love how they redesigned the front ends on these Pacificas. And you know, they look really good, especially with those silver wheels and Fathom Blue. Definitely a good looking color on this Pacifica. Let me know what you think about the color in the comments below. I know this uh, particular picture studio isn't the kindest to blue. I don't know if it's the tiles or the lighting, but uh, blue just sometimes shows up weird in this picture studio, but right here is a true color of it. Anyways, let's go look at that original window sticker so you can check out all the options on here. Feel free to pause this. I'm not going to go through everything, but most of it. 2024 Pacifica Touring L all-wheel drive, Fathom Blue, black alloy, black interior colors, Caprice leatherette bucket seats, 3.6 liter Pentastar with start-stop, 9-speed automatic transmission, 
Everything on your left here is standard on the Touring L package, including the adaptive cruise control, blind spot, lane departure, full speed collision warning plus, pedestrian emergency braking, and all those safety features there, all wheel drive suspension, latch, rear seat reminder alert, push button start, remote start. Interior features, those are also all the standard equipment. Exterior, 18 inch wheels, the bifunctional LED projector lamp headlamps, LED fog lamps, LED tail lamps, power lift gate, heavy duty radiator, radiator. The gloss black exterior mirrors and grill are also part of the Touring L package. Fathom Blue Pearl Coat is $4.95. Safety Sphere System is $11.95, which gives you the 360 camera, park sense front and rear park assist, and the per parallel and perpendicular park assist with stop. The dual pane panoramic sunroof is an $1,895 option. Total MSRP on this Pacifica is $50,080. If you want to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives on this particular Pacifica in the upper right hand part of the screen, there's a link to our website to this vehicle on our website where you can get all that pricing information. Three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain. There are your miles per gallon, 25 highway, 17 city, 20 average. And your safety ratings on this vehicle are fantastic. Five stars, pretty much up and down the board except rollover. Um, so definitely feel safe hauling your family around in this thing. And that's all I got on the Pacifica. Thank you so much for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. And to see more pictures of this van or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Pacificas, you name it. We got to go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and minivan walkarounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever-changing and vast new car inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this one. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Pacific of videos I've ever done in the upper right, link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to be offering this brand new 2024 Chrysler Pacifica Touring L all-wheel drive and Fathom Blue Pearl Coat. Thank you so much for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks again, and have a great day.